Hello, Pastor Karina Mel here. I wanted to make this video to encourage you today uh, to continue in the faith and in Christ and in abounding in His love. You know, this morning I read um, an article uh, of Derek Prince that arrived from the Post. It's just a little thing I would like to read to you, and it says, The first time Derek. I, Derek, Derek Prince, her Billy Graham speak was in London in 1954. One thing he said at the service never left me. He said, God never uses a discouraged Christian. When I read that, I wanted to read more. The example he gave was Gideon sitting behind the wine press threshing the wheat, hiding in utter discouragement. Then the angel came to Gideon in Judges 6.12 with the unexpected statement, The Lord is with you, you mighty man of valor. Gideon looked around to see whom the angel was talking to because he was cowering in fear. From the Midianites. The Lord had to change Gideon's picture of himself before he could do anything with him. The same is true with us. If we cannot look at ourselves through the eyes of faith, then we are scarcely eligible for God's service. A negative picture of ourselves will frustrate everything God wants to do for us unless we view things in a different light. Wow, that was so powerful, of course. Then the article goes into the armor of God given by the Lord that we have to be wary and be ready but one of the things that is so important as Christians is not to allow discouragement to get into our lives. And when discouragement comes, like Billy Graham said, we are useless. God cannot use us. So he is not wanting to discourage you, but there is an enemy he wants to discourage you. There is people who are don't know what they're doing and being used by the enemy to discourage you. But you today do what David do, did. He encouraged himself in the Lord. So go to God's presence, to your Father who loves you. And, and thank God for the covenant that we have with Jesus, with his blood, and who we are. On Sunday we were sharing that we are new creatures, new person in Christ because of that cleansing power of the blood of Jesus that has forgave us, that has wiped away all the sin in a way that it was if as we never seen before he justified us but also he has regenerated us completely brand new heart mind soul so that's something to be encouraged about be encouraged who you are in God and meditate in his word seeing what you are with the purpose of of him for you uh, love you all. God bless.